Hello, and welcome to the Timer Pit, your home for educational and timer videos. Today, I'm going to be going over Microsoft Sway, a site that students can create and share interactive reports and presentations. So on Microsoft Sway, it is a site that your students can create and share inter interactive reports and presentations. And I love using this with my students. So to get started, there's a little login um, or icon right here. It says sign into your account. So go ahead and click it. It's going to ask for you to sign in with your Microsoft account. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. So once you get logged into Sway, this is what your screen will look like. It's very simple and user friendly. So right here it says create new. So I'm going to go ahead and click it. So it's asking for, the, for you to title your Sway. My students currently are working on types of bridges. So that's on the type in for my title types of bridges. You can see right here, I can put a little background picture in there if I want. I'm not going to mess with that right now. You can see there's a plus button right here. So I'm going to go ahead and click it. So it gives me some choices of things to put in here. Headings, text, media, images. I'm going to go ahead and click image. Now what I like about this, it's very intuitive because you already can see over here, it's taken what I have typed in my title to help me with my search types of bridges. So if I were to click it, you can see there's all types of bridges already popping up. Now I'm, I'm going to search for a specific type of bridge. I'm going to put Golden Gate Bridge. And you can see here there's some wonderful pictures of the Golden Gate Bridge. I'm going to go ahead and select this one here and click Add. And over here, I can put in a little caption. So I'm going to type the name of the bridge, Golden Gate Bridge, and then put San, Fran, San Francisco. California. Now I can, you, know, you can see right here, I can click the plus button again. If I want to continue, I can keep doing the same thing over and over again. Now, if you want to share your project when you're finished with your teacher, just click the share button up here and you can see it provides a link for you to share that link with your teacher. You can see you can either give them view rights or editing rights. Also, you can play the presentation. I'm going to go back to one I've already done. Click here, types of robots. This is one my eighth grade class was working on, and I'm gonna go ahead and click play. So you can see, it kind of gives a nice, nice little beautiful presentation for your kids to display what they know about that topic. Thank you for watching. Make sure you click the subscribe button below so you can stay up to date with future educational videos coming soon.